Hey guys, it's Michelle here from Kiss by Coco. Um, the plan was to do the video and you guys see um, me actually making the soap. <laughs> that didn't work because Noah kept making noise in the background and he's home from school today because mommy woke up way too late, forgot about the time change of course and all that good stuff. So, Oh well life goes on so I just wanted to show you guys um, pretty much how I do the tops of the soap <laughs> I will be coming back with another video to show you me actually making the entire batch um, the attempt was to pipe the top I got impatient that didn't work so I just poured the mess out okay so here we go the white is still not um, where I would like it but it's at a decent consistency and I really wanted a lot of color um, on the top but primarily white so this is where I start, just putting shapes at the top, just a circular shape at the top, trying to show a little bit of color, but not too much. Then I go back, see the white is still not where I want it to be, but it's okay, who cares, it's just soap, right, it's going to all go into your skin. This one was made with buttermilk. Um, no yogurt this time. Buttermilk clay, uh, callan clay, um, oatmeal. Guys, I tell you, soap making is like the most relaxing ever. I love it. So I did start a video. <laughs> I did start one, but Noah um, just wouldn't be quiet, man. Which drives me nuts. All right, so I'm going to stop there. Um, it's hard to not keep going on the tops. And then once you got a really nice top, then you always end up messing the darn thing up because <laughs> you just don't want to stop. It's so relaxing. I guess it's the same as somebody smoking a cigarette. I wouldn't know. But it's something, you know, it's hard to stop because it, it does something to you, I guess. All right, so there is the top, and I'm going to go and get my um, decorations. Well, actually, I'll just leave it as is. I like it that way, and I'll just put my white glitter on the top. I don't have my puffer it's in my um, storage area. And of course, my hands are clean. I just took my gloves off. And of course, I forgot to spray my alcohol. But a little soda ash isn't going to hurt anybody. Sometimes. I don't get soda ash, which is weird if I don't spray alcohol. What it seems like when I do spray it is when I freaking get it. So that's that. That's um, your mint, I'm sorry, tranquil mint. And it has a very light mint smell to it. Right? 
so be sure to stop back by for the cutting video tomorrow I'm going to clean up my area here and clean up the um, the box a little bit more so I'll see you guys tomorrow alright bye